This movie wasn't a success here in the U.S., but it was quite a hit in Europe. Julie Christie being the it girl of the moment when the movie opened. She'd been a huge hit, of course, in Dr. Zhivago, then won an Oscar for the movie Darling. But the slow box office on this movie cooled down the enthusiasm for her quite a bit. Although Ingrid Bergman, for one, said in the 60s, said, and I quote Ingrid, Julie Christie has the most forceful personality of all the young actresses working in films today. But critic Kenneth Tynan, never known for his charm in his reviews, called Julie Christie, and I quote him, a hockey captain with romantic leanings. Well, she's since proven any doubters wrong, as she continues a career that in recent years included a Best Actress Academy Award nomination in 2008 for the movie Away From Her. Up next, Peter Finch in another John Schlesinger film, one that earned Oscar nominations for both Peter and John, as well as Peter's leading lady in the film, Glenda Jackson. Tonight on Turner Classic Movies, Peter Finch gets in bed with Murray Head in Sunday Bloody Sunday. Then Peter is found guilty in the trials of Oscar Wilde, and Maureen Jack Webb calls the shots as a D.I. 